Hey guys, Ares here, bringing you another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can duplicate resources in Fallout 4. All you need is a settlement. I'm at Century Hills, and you need a workshop. So I got one right here. Gonna enter my workshop, and now you wanna find an item you wanna duplicate. Um, an item that you can scrap and store is probably what you want, because if you if you pick an item that you cannot store and scrap at the same time, um, you obviously won't be able to do the duplication. So I'm gonna get some. Let's see what I need to duplicate. What am I running low on? Some silver. I only have three thousand and fifty nine. Gonna pick these up. Now I'm gonna drop them on the ground. Gonna drop them right here. Gonna. Okay, I need I need them to drop in one pile because. You can duplicate all of them at once instead of duplicating two at the same time. Um, so now I'm going to enter my workshop. Going to hover over the item. So I'm hovering over silver. And now I'm going to hit scrap and store at the same time. And if I do it correctly, I should have both prompts show up on my screen. So you want to hit scrap and store, if you're on PC and Xbox, PS4, whatever you're on, scrap and store. So you want to hit scrap, store, and when you hit store, you want to hold on to the store button. So if you do this, if you see this, then you've done it correctly. So you want to hit scrap and then store at the same time. Scrap and then store. Nope. There we go. And you want to hold the store button. I'm holding the store button, because if you let go, then the first prompt will disappear like it has. And we don't want that to, we don't want the first prompt to disappear. Okay. So I'm holding the store button and I want to scrap the item, so I'm going to hit X and now I can let go of the store button. And now I want to store the item as well. So now if I go back to silver, which is all the way down here, I should have duplicated the item. Silver. Okay, there we go. Now I have 6,118 and I can duplicate it more. So I'm going to drop it again. It's going to drop in two piles. I'm going to pick them up because I want one pile once my game stops saving. There we go. Gonna hit, gonna enter my workshop again. Hover over the item. Gonna hit scrap and store and hold the store button. There we go. Gonna scrap the item, gonna store the item. Now let's see, should have duplicated again. Oh, not on junk, let me go back to junk. So you can do this with any item that you can scrap and store. Um, if you do this with weapons and armor, you don't actually duplicate the weapon and armor. Um, it just scraps the um, item and it just becomes, um, you know, so if you scrap a pistol, it'll just become steel. So there's no point of doing that. So then, as you can see, I duplicated the silver because I have 12,000, um, 12,236. So what's another item I could duplicate? Let's see. Let's do some tin cans because I only have 282. Gonna grab them. Most gonna drop them on the ground. People are good at breaking things. Okay, it dropped us one pile, which is good. Together. Into my workshop. Gonna look at the item. Gonna scrap and store. Didn't get it. There we go. Hold the store button. Scrap the item. Store the item. And now it should have duplicated. Now I'm we'll gonna have to go all the way down, which is kind of annoying. yeah so what did I do 10 cans 10 10 10 cans where are you there oh did it not work maybe I didn't get it oh no it should have oh, okay never mind it just makes it into steel never mind so yeah, if you if you see um, I didn't read that properly but yeah so if you do the duplication glitch with this um, tin cans it'll just make the tin cans into steel so if I go to my steel it should have it. Ju it should have just made it into steel, not tin cans. 
So if I if I do if I duplicate a damaged camera, instead of me getting two damaged cameras, I'm just gonna get um, I'm gonna get the damaged camera back, but I'm also gonna get two gears, two springs, and two crystals. So that's the same thing that will happen if you do it with weapons and armor. If you scrap weapons and armor, you'll get the weapon back, but you'll just get steel as well or rubber. But if you do it with items like um, when they're in their pure form, I I could say pure form. So if I if I duplicate spring, I'll just get spring and nothing else. So if I do it right now, drop the spring, drop some two. Okay. Why why it's dropping in two is because one one um one of the item is the original and one is the duplicate. Which is why you want to pick them back up and drop it as one. Do it. Ugh. It's kind of hard to get around, so you want to hit scrap and then store at the same time, like straight after the other. There we go. And hold on, hold the store button. Scrap the item, store the item, and now if I go to spring, this navigation is really annoying because I have to go all the way down. I can't go from can't make it go from top to bottom. Um, what did I just do? Spring. Okay, there we go. Now I have 19,238. So you can just keep doing this over and over again. You can do this with shipments as well. I have shipments right here. Um, same thing with shipments. If you duplicate them, instead of actually becoming... Um, so I have 17 steel shipments. Instead of becoming... Um, duping instead of that duping it's just gonna make um it's just gonna give me steel instead of um more shipment i'll keep my 17 shipment but i'll just get more steel but yeah. so i don't think i have a weapon that i can duplicate on me which i can show um we'll check Oop. Let's see a weapon that i can duplicate um no so i can't can't really show a weapon off, but um, because you can't scrap um legendary items, but any like so if you do a pipe pistol, instead of you getting two pipe pistols, you'll just get the pipe pistol you originally had, and just um some steel. But that's pretty much how you um duplicate resources, so you can keep duplicating resources and build settlements and like um build your turrets, and if you have supply lines, then you can just duplicate in one settlement like I have. I duplicate everything in Century Hills and then I have supply lines um, which I can show you right here. If I go to supply lines so I have just supply lines and everything I can just build at all of these areas because everything is supplied through Century Hills. But that's pretty much how you do the glitch and it's a pretty easy glitch as well. Nothing too hard so thanks for watching guys, I'll see you guys later.